I got an idea, what if I just use this dusty ass laptop right here and I ask AI how to boost my FPS. We're gonna be trying that out with a couple of games, but do not worry, let's get right into it, come on. As you guys can see, this is some random ThinkPad laptop with a i7-8850H CPU, 32GB of DDR4 RAM, UHD graphics, and an NVIDIA Quadro P1000. Now let me be honest, this GPU is not made for games, and it is a studio GPU, so I think this qualifies as a potato laptop, okay? Now the games we're going to be taking a look at is Fortnite, Roblox, and another game that's really hard to run on a shit laptop. Alright, I have my two games that we're going to be installing, and I already have my Roblox right there there we got control in fortnite and from what i've heard i've heard that control is a very very hard triple a game to run and i've actually seen a couple of benchmarks on it as for fortnite yeah i can say the same with it i'm pretty sure it's considered as a triple a game these days and then we have roblox which is very very low end based you can basically do so many customizations with it but it is not up to me to make the customizations it is up to ai speaking of ai i have three ai agents that i can use number one deep seek number two chat gpt and number three gemini i'm gonna ask google to give me numbers from one to three and one is gonna be gemini two is gonna be chat gpt and three is gonna be deep sea if i get any one of these numbers i'm gonna have to use that for the rest of the video if you guys do want me to try boosting my fps with any of the other ai's i will do so but i just wanted to make this pretty fun all right we have a random number generator i'm gonna choose my number as you guys see it says three right here but that does not count because i spammed the generate button a bunch of times to make sure that we can clear this generator anyways time for my microphone to press the keyboard we got two all right y'all now before we're gonna even delve into any of this i'm gonna ask ai to optimize my low-end computer okay i have a low-end pc with a quadro p1000 how can i make it better for gaming all right it's asking me to tweak in-game settings update drivers optimize windows for gaming cleaning and maintain your system use performance boosters i'm not gonna lie the first two are like the most obvious ones if i'm trying to be specific though i'm really asking it to modify my windows so let's ask that all right i asked it can you modify my windows and do any performance boosts that will assist me with gaming let me click enter and we have a bunch of tweaks right here what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to go through all the tweaks and yeah that should allow us to go test out the games without those modifications all right y'all i got my controller and i got all three of those games right there i know y'all see a roblox player control in fortnite what we're about to be doing is we're going to be going into fortnite straight away let's see how it plays let's be honest i'm in the lobby i'm not gonna lie the game has never felt this smooth in the menu before uh from what i remember but what we're going to be doing is we're going to be putting all the graphics all the way down and never mind they're actually all all the way down all right we're in the lobby i'm not gonna lie you guys can probably see how bad it is right now we're like stuttering yo it says we're actually sitting at a nice frame rate but this game is pretty stuttery it has never been this smooth before am i bugging yo, there's no way that this computer ends up being playable on fortnite all right there's someone right here if i can get a kill then you know that's that's oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my yo this game is so bad this game is running out like what 60 70 80 fps sit seven all right let's ask gpt the question they gave us the game plan okay so resolution lower to 720p set fps to 60 fps okay got that use full screen 3d resolution to 50 percent. i did this i did all of this already okay i technically did all of it i'm gonna ask it to make a powershell command that modifies my in-game files for all these settings okay i got this handy dandy script you guys see that little file that says for the fps boost i do not know if you see it but i'm gonna run in administrator permissions never mind i cannot i'll just run with powershell apparently it worked guys uh i don't know we'll see the script didn't work at all but i literally just made the modification to myself and we're in the game game looks clearly more shit let's get into a battle royale as i put these performance boost the game has less latency and it feels like it's way more playable and i'm not going to lie though this whole map is unseeable you cannot see a single thing fps seems consistent we have surpassed over the 90 fps's and this is what i call real gameplay right here oh my gosh no get a gun get a gun Get a gun, 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 get a gun. Play, play it, please, 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 please. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm die, I'm die. Bro, okay, well, whatever. Listen, we managed to improve our FPS by like 30, 40, and yeah, that's really all that matters. Without further ado, let's get into the next game. I have not tried control at all, but it's gonna be my first time playing it. So I tried left and right to run control, and for some odd reason, it just will not run on this laptop. So we are left with our only option, Roblox. We are gonna be having an FPS boost test on Roblox. Okay, great. I really don't expect this to actually play relatively good, but we'll see how it does. I am gonna be forced to 
to play this on keyboard and mouse. I tried to do it with the controller, but it just didn't work. This game actually seems to be playing really good. Why have I never had this experience, bro? Maybe, yo, I really think what changed the trajectory of this video is literally the first thing that we did, the chat GPT optimizations. There was no way that my game was able to run this good on this laptop, and I know it. I know it for a fact. Like, my game can't even run this good on the Mac. I've literally applied optimizations on the Mac, and it doesn't run this good. Right now, I'm sitting in the 130s to 120 FPS range. This is actually insane. Before we get on to the optimizations, what I'm going to consider doing is getting a kill. Who knows? Maybe I can get one. Yep. Oh, that's close. That's close. Yep. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, third time's a charm. Uh, oh, am I going to get this one, though? Oh, wait. Hold on. Wait. Wait, wait. Maybe I should quit Roblox. Maybe I should quit. Ro okay, anyways. That was Roblox without any FPS boost. Uh, let's go for the boosting. All right, so I asked ChatGPT a ton of questions on how to boost my FPS, and it really doesn't say much. It says use Roblox graphics settings in game. I already did that. I already made my graphics quality to one. Uh, check Roblox configuration. Make a script, please. I have the script. What I'm going to be doing now is I'm going to be going into PowerShell. Yes. This doesn't seem to be working. Oh, and it actually, hold on, wait, wait, it actually might have worked. This is it, guys. This is it. Literally the last draw, the modification that ChatGPT has given me to make my game more playable. Okay, I'm going to be honest. There is definitely a noticeable difference in the game quality. Maybe, maybe it's placebo. I do not know, but the game does look worse. We're staying in the same FPS range, but we're also going around the 130s to 150 ranges. So this actually might be a win. We might have actually gotten 20 more FPS than I thought we would. And that's it, guys. To be honest, that is AI helping you boost your FPS. And that's what I did. Bro, this video took hella long to make. Y'all really did enjoy it. Consider dropping a sub because I really might make more videos with this laptop i really do love tech i have a passion for this i also have a passion for video gaming i actually do make a couple of roblox videos but that is it i tested that gpt and checked if it could help me boost my fps in video games that's it for the video y'all take care and